of people on YouTube, this is me and my beloved husband, who you haven't seen in a video in probably like three years. Anyway, it's exactly what the title says. We went to Whole Foods and we picked up a butt ton of different oysters. And both you and I are a bit of oyster connoisseurs. So, we're gonna eat them, we're gonna rate them. Honey, as the man in this relationship, here's the shucker. And also, there's gloves. I don't know if you need them, but it came with gloves. Yeah, I haven't uh, I haven't opened oysters in years, many years. Uh, don't take I your eye out. Don't, don't take my eye out. Really, I just cut it out if I take too long. All right. Cut it so out. what are we starting so with? So we're starting with fresh farm raised Atlantic well fleet oysters. Okay. Atlantic. So from the other side. These oysters traveled far. Yeah, the East Coast oysters are a little bit easier to open. You see people like the farmer's market do this like without any bees. They're like... Boss used to be a pro with this. Oh! Not the best oyster opening of the first one, but hey, at least I got it open. Good job, baby. So, okay. here you go. Okay, well, if the shell can be put in there. I have a scoop of food there. This is a bunty little oyster. I can just open the other one. Let's see. This one came out easier. Yeah. Good. Good, got it. Whatever Blake is doing, she's having a good time. Yeah, right. this, uh, um, this thing's you awesome. Can, you can use it, but maybe it comes off. It's not doing any more about it. Alright, um, I have lemon, there's hot sauce, there's cocktail sauce. What do you have in honey? Lemon? I just had some lemon. Alright, well, I like cocktail sauce on my oysters, so I will take a little glob of this. Cocktail sauce? Cocktail this sauce. thing? That is a garlic hot sauce, and the other one's a habanero. The habanero is probably spicy. Vinegar aged red habanero pepper. Are you ready? To my, my oyster's ready. Vegetable blend, carrots, onions, garlic, santan gum, guar gum. Mm, I don't think I like the gum. Okay, so fine. Alright, ready. One, two, three. I got. I need uh, my uh, fork. Alright, I'll get a fork. I mean, I can have it like this probably, but for the next one I need a fork. Alright, 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 let's go. It was good, but it was exceedingly too small. Here, it was mini. Alright, let me get the fork. Ooh, sorry. It's a little bit salty. Yes, uh, that was the fresh farm raised Atlantic Wild Fleet Oyster. Yeah. Good, number one. Moon Dancer Oysters. I like the name, Moon Dancer Oysters. Where are these from? Uh, I don't know, they're from Whole Foods, but no, who knows <laughs> where they originated from. Haha. <laughs> um, and a light blue point oyster. Okay, now let's start with the Moon Dancers. Yeah, but I want to start with the East Coast first because they're easier to open. Atlantic. That's another Atlantic one. Good, right, yeah. What are these? Fresh farm waste. Could tweet. Could Atlantic. Could Atlantic oysters. Whatever this could tweet is. Could tweet. Could tweet. Okay, well, you're getting that open. I'm going to close the door for Blake is playing a loud game, so. I think that's why you should wear the gloves. <laughs> ah, that's what the gloves are for! Ah, okay, now I understand. Honey, honey, honey. Ooh. <laughs> Mommy and Daddy are doing a video. Yeah. Okay. You have to get two halves here. Okay, so we got this. Maybe you get a plate for you, but I can put yours on the plate and not on the table. Honey. Use the gloves. My hands are super dirty. Don't wash your hands. Put on the gloves. Oh, the last one. 
Yeah, Ben's guessing you guessing me no flat. I got a flavor of yours that we're going to share. Oh, okay, good. We're just three oysters in and Basti's already bleeding. Here you go. It came with the gloves. You know what? I'm not going to sit next to you when you chuck these oysters because I feel like it's going to go right in my face. Ah. If you're hearing all these side effect, sound effects, it's because we have a child. She will be playing different games. Kind of. Do you need the second one? Oh, no. All right, there goes Buffs. I'm doing something wrong with the opening. I just don't know what yet. This one. Gonna find it out. Mm -hmm. Luckily, we have so many oysters. This one. Honey, mommy to practice. To... Mommy has to look for that one, okay? No, no, no. Not this one. This one. Oh, mine, is, mine has what's it called? Cocktail sauce. Which is a very American thing. You can't find cocktail sauce in other countries. As I discovered. One give it a globby glow. Yeah, I think I need a plate. Cause... Oh, sorry, I'll get you a plate. It's tough to share these. Yeah. Oh, it was good. Yeah, and slightly bigger. Yeah, that one was definitely a, a bigger oyster. Still relatively small, though. Yeah. Here you go. Thank you very much. Good. Yum. That was a uh, Food Point Oysters, Atlantic. What is it, honey? Too cold. You're too cold? Why are you cold? Okay. What else we got here? Bruce's Beach House Shell on Pacific Oysters. Bruce's Beach? That's here, right? I don't know. I think Bruce's Beach is here in California. Okay. I think. So, Moon Dancer Oysters. Okay, let's try the Moon Dancers. Let's see, Moon Dance Oysters. They're farm raised. Uh, I think they're all farm raised. They Most farm oysters raised? are farmed. Farm raised. They're, farm I mean, they're raised, still in the ocean, but they're like farm they're. Raised, you know what they mean by? Raised. They're all farm. Yeah, they're all farm raised. Yeah, it's very rare to find like like just regular ocean oysters. You you farm them. You they're in the ocean. Like you do raise them in the ocean. So they come from an oyster farm. But they come from like a farm that they set up in the ocean. All right. These? These look big. These are the moon dancers? In here. Yeah. All right. They're definitely slightly bigger. But maybe they're one of these things where like they look big and then you open it up and nothing. Small. Yeah, this one is actually also small. I think these are probably even also uh, Atlantic oysters actually. I don't know, but let me move while you do that. I do not want to be stabbed. Like, also move. Yeah, here we got that one. And where's number two? Oh, I put it in. You got it, honey. You did it. You beat that oyster. Like the man you are. No oysters fan to tan. Okay, yours looks nice and plump. Yeah, this one is big. Yeah. Much bigger than yours. I know. I found out the camera it was put out. But yeah, I totally got oyster rings here. Honey, can you please play that game somewhere else? I'm not going Okay, I'm ready when you are. Which are these, the moon dancers? I'll have a look for the name after eight. Alright, ready? Hey, you want one more? You want one more, honey, not you. I like that one a lot. Yeah, it's fantastic, really like ocean. Yeah, this one, I've, it's so far it's my favorite one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's definitely better than the first two. Yeah, the first one being too shitty. Too, it's too small, yeah. Yeah, I'm like, kind of bunchy little crab oysters are these. This Moon Dancer, it's more meaty, but it also tastes nice. Okay. 
Moon Dance, I'm pretty sure. Have a look at the name again. Yeah, Moon Dance, huh? That's the Moon Dance. You'll refill that. I will empty these bowl already. So yeah, these so are like thicker, like a deeper oyster. These are Pacific oysters. You don't do that. Huh? Yeah, of course. Yeah. Uh, no, but, but look how spiky they are. Alright, I don't know if I mean anything, but what is it, honey? Yeah, the um, Pacific ones are usually a little bigger and a little spikier. Oh no. Maybe you gotta get it from the front. No, it's always from the front. So you don't need Martha Stewart to teach you what it is? I don't know. I think all right, getting all right, quite... all right. Waxy's right. oyster technique is improving. We're getting there. Not perfect, but I think I can learn by doing. Alright, this one's meaty, at least the one I have here looks a little less meaty. Yeah, they all come out a little bit different. And I will try and see. That one was quite salty. Yeah, very salty. What good? Well, I, think this, I think that's the best so far. Really? I like the last one the best, the Moon Dancer. Also, it has a cool name. Moon Dancer. That was Fresh Carl's Budlino, I guess. Alright, so since we are on the Pacific Coast anyway, I expect most of them to be Pacific. Good. Now what we got got? Uh, live Blue Point oysters next. They all kind of feel small, actually, a little bit. Compared to the restaurant oysters. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Maybe they just feel bigger because they already open and look Maybe. bigger than I don't know. All right. Here you go. Uh. Hey, you sitting there, honey? Small but tasty. Yeah, that's the best one so far. That one's good. What is this one called? This was light blue something. Light blue point oysters. Blue point oysters. Yeah. Yeah, the light blue point oysters were the best so far. But it, they, they were good balance tasting. Definitely the best ones. Yeah. Good. Now we have Bruce's Beach, Takara Pacific, and Royal Amethyst. Okay. Good. Then I would say let's start with uh, Bruce's Beach. Okay, let's try Bruce's Beach. I have a feeling like Bruce's Beach is in Europe, California. I don't know why. <laughs> Embarrassing geography knowledge. <laughs> these are very small, actually. I think these are actually. Uh... Mm, I don't know. Oh, I don't know. I know. What happened, honey? I know. I know what? You want to take this off? This one, mm -hmm. this one, the bus. What? The yeah. bus could be you. You want to watch Poppy on the bus? Uh-huh. Okay, we'll put it on your phone. No, that's on the tea. 
Okay, we can't use the TV right now. Mommy and Daddy are doing the video. After Mommy and Daddy are done, you can have it, okay? <laughs> da -da. Thank you. That one was actually easy to open. Okay, well, we'll keep that in mind. This should be in our oyster rating, is like how easy is it to open. Yeah, but I'm also improving <laughs> as we go, so it will be easier and easier. See? Best to get the touch. Okay, well, this is a, like a deep oyster, so it's got meat. Maybe right. even you are. No, there's no lemon coming out anywhere. I like this one a lot. Get some other lemons. That is a good oyster. Is that one of Bruce, Bruce's Beach? Mm -hmm. Bruce, you make a good oyster. If I do say so. Mm. Mm. That was even a little bit sweet. Yeah, I like that one actually. That one yeah, was, that was good. really good. As good as the last one. It's not even better. I like that one. Bruce's Beach is worth a second go. Good. Now the raw amethyst is perfect. All right. Ordered up. Got it. Mommy, chocolate. Mm -hmm. I think I got better with it now. You're already ate all the chocolate. Chocolate. The chocolates are finished. All I have is happy birthday chocolate. It's the only chocolate left, sorry. No! The other ones are finished. I don't need the chocolates. Fine, I'll give you that. But that's normal. Oh! Alright. Oh, let's see how this amethyst oyster is. Good. good. <laughs> I was about to say, I was like, that is the best oyster. It feels like every oyster we get. Yeah, like uh, it's gradually going yeah. better up. It really um, was my plan. <laughs> so the amethyst, that yeah. is my favorite. The amethyst, sweet. That was a good oyster. <laughs> last three were all good. The first one we had wasn't that good. Only because it was small. Not that it didn't taste good, but it was like too tiny. Oh, this one was expensive. No, I bought... Six of them. It was, oh. it was the cheapest, actually. These were the on sale ones. <laughs> ah, they were the biggest of the most expensive. No, 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 no. no. These but are. Good, the Takara Pacific oysters. AKA the ones that were on sale. <laughs> That's why I bought more of them. Good. So we each get three of them. Mm -hmm. <laughs> So we advance about the fish shit in it. It's fine, guys. All right, I'll get these going. As I'm low on time, it is. Also, Jose sent a message. Hi. Good. Open them up. Yes, perfect. All right. What? All right, right, right. I'll say this, they're easy to fork. Alright. Mm. Yeah, for being the cheapest, they're actually really good. <laughs> It's a little bit salty again, but I like it. Number four for me. Well, thank you for joining us in our oyster eating experience. I'm sure everybody on YouTube really wanted to see this. Bye-bye for now, guys.